What's good people here, your boy John K back with another video guys. Today we're gonna we're gonna be focusing on uh, a defender man, a very um, I don't know if he's still playing, I think he's retired. Vidic. Bro, people say Van Dyke is good and don't I do you know what? I do think Van Dyke is the best defender. <sighs> I'm not gonna say ever. I don't know. I mean he did win a Ballon d'Or and then it's just that for me, Van Dyke has everything. He can defend, he's physical, he's tall, he he tackles, um, he can ping balls like from it from literally left, right, use both feet. Um, so you could consider him as one of the best. But Vidic was an out and out beast. He wasn't as big as Van Dyke, but this guy, like, he didn't care who you were, he's going through you. Like he's going in challenges, like he was a beast. Um, but yeah, guys, we're gonna we are literally gonna see what this guy could could have you know could do um, when he was playing at Manchester United. Um, I don't like I said I don't think he was like ever good enough to win a Ballon d'Or, but because of like the goals, no, he didn't really score goals, and maybe the part the technical passing wasn't there. I don't know. I really don't know. I can't remember watching Vidic that much when I was young. But all I know is that he was like, when it comes to defending, he was the best. Out and out defender, quality. Um, guys, before we start this video, guys, remember, have a look at these products. Yeah, these products will improve your game. I'm telling you, they have improved my game tenfold. I'm telling you, man. Um, rebounders, uh, rebound nets, um, even this the boot buddy. Obviously, if you like... If you're a football, if you play football and you don't own own a boot buddy, then you need to get one. Like it is the quickest and easiest product. It's probably one of the best products ever made for cleaning boots. It's it's a joke. So go ahead and check that out. And obviously the equipment, you can get the basic equipment. You can get the higher tier equipment. Um, if you want top quality results, go for the quality equipment. Don't go for the basic equipment. Um, even though it is a lot cheaper, if you want quality results, go for the quality equipment. Um, even the rebound nets, they're so good for your touch. The rebound boards, they're so good for short passes, long uh, driven passes as well. Um, it's improved my game tenfold and I'm a central midfielder. But I, I personally think all of the, whatever position you play in, they it those those that equipment will improve your game. So even if it's personal or if it's for someone that you know that plays football, Honestly, it will improve your game tenfold. Um, but anyway, guys, make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Uh, without further ado, let's get straight into this video. He got an elbow to the... What a tackle. What a tackle that is. Bang. Hey, yo, Jaco. See the tackles like tackles like that, yeah. Now play if you were playing now in the Premier League, yellow card. You can't hit challenges like that anymore. He got the ball and he took the man. It's a yellow card. What a tackle though. 
He's heading that ball. He don't care. He's so strong. Too strong. Too strong. You can't get past him as a defender. You ain't getting past him, man. He's quality. Is that Inter Milan? Is that Inter Milan? Ugh. He's there, he's there, he's there. Oh, he's... Do you know what, yeah? He he might not be the quickest defender, yeah, but he's just, like, very good at knowing when to press, knowing when to make the tackle, knowing where to be, in like, position-wise, knowing when to go, then maybe sit. Like, he, his positional play is so good, and... Obviously, he has aggression. He has physicality about him as well, which makes him even better. Um, but I just love the way he moves, the way he... It's almost like he gives himself that time and space to realise, OK, I've got a bit of time here. I'm going to let him come to me, and then I'm going to make my move. Like, he's just so intelligent in that way. No, you don't mess about with it. You don't mess around. He just defends. Again, he's there. Put your body on the line. Oh, again. Messi again. Honestly, 
vamos e tomar! Just puts his body on the line for everyone, for the team. You don't see that in defenders today. You do have a few of them. Uh, Rudiger, Van Dijk. But you don't see you don't see defenders putting their body on the line like then. I mean, yeah, that's a bad tackle. Oh. He's so good, man. So he knows where to be at the right time. That's why he was captain. That's why he was captain. That's exactly why. No, 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 no. No, you don't. No, you don't. That's not a foul. Barcelona again. Yeah, it's the same tackle, I was going to say. That is a great tackle, by the way. Look at the... Sh yeah, he got pushed in the back there, to be fair. Here he is again. That's what I mean. They don't... Manchester United don't have a defender like that. It's not a foul. Bang. No, nope, you ain't getting past. <laughs> you are not getting past Vidic, man. I'm telling you. Here we go again. I just want him. I just want him to hit a hard tackle now. I'm just waiting for that hard challenge. That's against Reading QPR. Yeah, he's too strong. Too strong. That was a good touch. Smash him! I want him to smash someone, man. I didn't know he had that in his locker. Oh man, Vidic man, he was he was so such a good defender. Like I said, um he probably did have that pass in his locker. I just you just don't see much of it. Um but like I said, out out and out defender, I'll probably say he might have been better than Van Dijk as an out and out defender. Van Dijk has a lot of natural genetic ability like he is lucky unfortunate enough to be as big as he is as tall as he is um so you're not going to get past him but Vidic he wasn't that bulky he wasn't he was tall but he wasn't as tall as Van Dijk he was just an intelligent defender knew where to be in the right time um drew drew the fouls uh very good at tackling very good at heading he was an out and out defender he just didn't care like 
And I think people were frightened of him is because like he had that mentality was, I don't care if my face is cut. Like I remember that one game where his face got cut up. He can, he doesn't care. Like he, he, he would put his body on the line for that Manchester United team. And that's what I believe Manchester United are missing. They're missing people that are willing they're not willing they're not willing to put their body on the t on the line they're not willing to give 100 percent. i'll probably say the only player that's willing to give 100 percent is someone like ronaldo because when you can see throughout ronaldo's career he's had that mentality of giving everything he's got but some of those players it's like they're doing they're playing at like a 60 70 percent level it's like yeah i'm getting paid good money like yeah 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 we're playing we're playing those uh those uh young boys yeah 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 it'll be it's like they have that attitude it's like yeah well and it's like it's bullshit excuse my french it is it's bs man like you need they should be watching players like vidic if i was a player in that manchester united team and i was having maybe a bad spell i wasn't playing or i would be going to ex players like that i'm like writing everything tell me what was it what did you do what were your football rituals what did you study what what do you think affects you? Is it like, look at him. Like he he was one of the best players there in that team. He was in doubt one of Manchester United's best defenders of all time. Like you just got to ask him, man, what his mentality was. And like I like I keep like I said, he put his body on the line for every tackle, every header. You can't beat that, man. You cannot beat that. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. More um, if you want me to react to more players um, of your taste. Let me know in the comment section. Guys, you here with your boy, Jordan GK, and I will see you in the next video.